Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode one of season two of Beastars. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Oh, we're starting right with the opening. Okay. Your girl been waiting since Monday. Thought the freaking subtitles and everything would come out for this, but no. It's like, cause didn't they do this in just for season one as well? Yeah, I think so. I don't remember. ready for this. The hell? Mm-mm. See? Mm-mm. Nope. Jack, get the fuck out. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. No. Huh? Oh. Drop it. Go. No, no, no! You idiot! No, don't go that way! No! No! Oh, someone ruined it. Oh, fuck. What the fuck is that? Hold up, now you going to tell- well, cause you know what, that makes sense, cause there was a snake in the opening! <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Just trying to scare him. Oh. 
Who? Oh, well, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's been gone for, like, how long now? <laughs> What's up? No, sorry. He's sorry. We need you. No. Well, at least you two still talk. We're gonna buy it and see how we get. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Mm, yeah, people get the wrong impression because of the fact that you two are together. And, uh, uh, <laughs> oh, you <I can> see. <laughs> oh. something not really complicated but it's something <laughs> oh my God. I, I, I wouldn't really consider it dating more like uh, you can't say friends with benefits because y'all ain't really fucking <laughs> Hanging out. <clears throat> of course. Because she still loves them. Nah, cause didn't he go back to um being captive? Oh damn! Cause he got, I think he what he sacrificed himself. <laughs> See, why the fuck? It, it, why are y'all walking down a dark hallway by yourself? I mean, come on. Jack learned his lesson. <sighs> Not quite. Uh -uh. Oh, God. Yeah, so, you know, we'll go in there. Yay, my eyes. <gasps> nope. <laughs> Oh no, a spider. 
That's what it has to be. Yeah. Because the spider has, like... It depends. Yeah. Some spiders will have, like, multiple different eyes. Yeah, it has to be an animal-human hybrid. But still, the only thing I can think of, especially with the eyes, is a spider. Because no fucking snake guy. <laughs> hmm? <gasps> huh? Are you serious? Sir, you can't do that. I know. <laughs> Something isn't right about this. Why? Not about that. But where will you go? <laughs> Wait until Haru sees his ass. Smart. Put a video camera up there. See, I don't think it's that. Like, okay, remember how at the end of season one we saw like, um, Legacy talking to someone. I don't think it's that person, but who knows? Of course, she called Dora.
Yeah, sure. She gonna slap your hand. Oh. <laughs> About her trying to be the next beast star. I mean, that is her goal. Okay, let's see. at the bottom or stay the same No, I mean, something about this ain't right. No, they don't hear it. So then it's a snake.
it, it, it's a snake, ain't it? Still might hear that sound though. Please. I mean, please, because that was... What is it? What is it? Come on now! See! <laughs> you can't do it! Be sorry to promise Neverland! Come on now! What is wrong with y'all today? Oh my god! Y'all just... <laughs> this is... We're gonna end abruptly today. You gotta wait till next week. I don't want to wait till next week, okay? I want to know now. N O W now, right the fuck now. You can't do that. That is so. That's bullshit. Bull. Uh uh. Okay. For you know a returning episode, this is good. I mean, there were moments where it felt slow, but I'm okay with that. I have no problem with it. Louise coming back like it's nobody's business, nobody's problem. Uh, and <laughs> like, are you serious? You, 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 him being gone for two months, two months, you know, not even saying where to go. What the fuck? I don't know. And then he resigns from the acting club. I, I, and I'm wondering, okay, where are you going to go now? What's next for you? And y'all was like, nothing. He le he says, like, a really uh, interesting quote to Legacy about the light and darkness aspect. And it kind of think it, it makes me kind of think that Legacy isn't darkness anymore. He's light. But maybe Louise is now darkness with the situation of his past coming in and such from season one because I'm guessing we're gonna possibly let's say maybe by like episode two or episode three we might get an explanation of seeing a little bit more of what else happened to him at the end of season one and then getting into season two when he comes back to the school like it's nobody's freaking business I don't know but you you, <laughs> you can't like you, you can't have this dude come back and, and just barely answer questions then you got the fact that Haru possibly doesn't know anything Haru hasn't seen him yet and such I do love the fact that you know Legacy and Haru are talking still and they're trying to deepen their relationship or their friendship together because yes, a guy and a girl <clears throat> can be friends without any romantic feelings, even though yes, like as he <laughs> like loves her and such, but it, it just seems like right now Haru still isn't giving him the time of day. And that's okay. Most girls we like to do that until we are um really fully committed to ourselves that we're we're 100% sure that we really because you know first time because even there are some guys who are like this like we don't they don't know like mm, you know mm, yeah like you, you cute you good like has this relationship's nice but we you know you never know and, and she is comfortable with the way things are maybe she just doesn't want everything to change especially because the fact is they're meeting in secret all the time but Legacy doesn't like that. You can see it all over his face. And especially, you know, he, I love the fact that he got excited just to go talk to her. But 
he hates the fact that they have to talk in secret. If they can't, he wants to do it out in public, but because, you know, she's a small animal and he's a big animal, you know, yeah, well, it's supposed to eat the rabbit. Um, of course, yeah, people are going to talk and everything because rumors, because, you know, ish. Because people gossip, you know. I don't know. I, I, I just. I got no clue what the fuck is happening or what the hell is going to happen next. I want to know what that thing is, whether it's a snake, uh, um, a spider, something. It, it's something. I don't know what. My money is on a snake right now after this. Because what making that noise? A fucking snake. I don't know. But come on now. It's got to be a damn snake. So. Can it be now? Can it be? Uh, I can't speak. Can it be Monday now? Because I need to know. Right now. Okay? Like right now. But this was a really good episode. I, I just enjoyed it. I just need an episode on Louise before um, everything that happened between the end of season one when the last time we saw him and then him coming back. That's it. Other than that, it was a damn good first episode, and I loved it. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode one of season two <clears throat> of Beastars. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially, okay, either next Monday for episode two or, if not, probably um, Wednesday. I'm not 100% sure on how they're going to do this because the fact is, you know, Episode comes out Monday, and it might not get subbed until, like, Tuesday, Wednesday. But, yeah. Whenever episode two comes out, that is the next time you'll see me. But I will see you guys all next time. Bye!